All right, guys, welcome back to another Steam walkthrough. Today we have Unishroom, and this game looks adorable, <laughs> so I'm pretty excited. That's King Mushroom. I'm get. Oh, he does have the crown. Mush City is is a city in which only the three basic color schemes exist: red, green, and blue. Oh, I thought it'd be red, blue, and yellow, but all right. Oh, oh, a yellow mushroom was born, loved by his family but hated by the village elders. A color that isn't similar to ours is a sign of a curse. He should be removed before we are doomed. They got little pitchforks, my goodness, these shrooms are evil. The child was to be distinguished from the city on his fourth birthday and to roam the city's force of evil by his own. For months past, four months past, and it was time for Eunice Room to leave the city and go meet his harsh fate. He is adorable. I can't, I can't get over it. Cuteness overload. But this game's like super cheap. It's like $2.69. Ooh, what am I doing here? Ooh, a little slidey. Okay. Is it a race? Can I jump? Oop. Oop. I died. Okay. It's a little slidey. Let's see. Can I slow down? Oh, yeah. I slow down by hitting things, I guess. But if I hit things too hard, I die. Hmm. One slidey boy. Maybe I just gotta get used to it, though. Oh man, that's hard. Do 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 do. <laughs> Straight off the edge. And he said his final words were Wee Splat. <laughs> God. Hmm. Okay. Oh, come on. We can do it. We got a little bit farther. At least we got hit by the second rock that time. Oh, man. I'm so not good at this game. <laughs> it's so much longer than it seems. Oh. Please, gosh, why is this? Uh, so long. <laughs> it's so long and it's so hard for a first stage. That's what she said. It's awful. <laughs> it's awful. <laughs> What's that shroom doing flying over top? Oh, I can't get past that one now. Not good at this game. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh baby oh we freaking made it thank god oh no we're still on the skateboard <laughs> oh i tried to go through the middle i'm a ding dong i had that uh I don't know what happened to my brain there. I should have known not to do that. Oh, I did it again. What is these white crystals make me want to cut to the middle for some reason? I don't know if it's because of the collar. Oh, you dick. <laughs> okay. Ooh. Wow. Wow, Luigi. <laughs> God. Okay, I'm getting I'm getting better. It's just really hard. I feel like this game's calling me an old fogey who can't skateboard. <laughs> oh man, like you can't skateboard. Oh, well, let me show you something, buddy. And then I fall, I'm gonna bust my ass and break my hip bone. <laughs> In my day, skateboarding was all we did. God, oh, so mad. We had it, dog. We had it. What happened? Ah. Oh, damn. 
That's like right at the end of the stage, dude. That's so freaking annoying that they got cut back like that. And then they got a three prong thing in front of that. I could barely see it. But I see it, and I know I'm gonna freaking mess that up at least once. I'm gonna be so tilted. Even more tilted than the last time I've messed up at the end. Oh, that was close. That's the end, and I, I knew I was gonna mess that up at least once. But that stupid little gap where you had to go through the sides, I knew I was gonna mess it up once, and it just happened. All right, guys, let me pause this. All right, so I was kind of play testing this, but so my suggestions would be Unless you wanted it to be this hard, like it is a very difficult game and most people when they come into like a little cute mushroom game are coming for the story and the cuteness. Which you do really well to start and it, I mean it looks like a great game, like the graphics are good. But difficulty wise, man, there's like too many obstacles, like if you wanted it to be that hard, I would suggest putting in like an easier mode for like casual players that just kind of want the story and the cuteness and something that's like relaxing because this is not relaxing this is hard and challenging and like the mechanics that make it too hard in my opinion are the fact that there's too many obstacles like every 2.5 seconds the board is super slidey so you have to adjust for the slide which makes it feel like you don't have like complete control over it and what else is there it goes so fast like you're just speeding dude there's no slow down button like even paperboy which is like an on rails kind of thing like this even though you had to throw a newspaper you could slow the the board the, the bicycle down so that's some things to consider and if you want to put in the slow mechanic but you still want it to be a little bit difficult like you could maybe implement like a time challenge so they have to like ration their slow mechanic i mean it's a cool game it's a good start and like i look forward to like further developments in the game i'll check back every now and then see if you like see the updates and see if i can actually like play through it because i Got so close to beating the second stage, but just that amount of difficulty. I've been playing this game for like an hour and a half now, and I haven't paid it past the second stage. You, you can't tell you're getting better the more you play it, but it just feels like there's too much going on for me anyways. I'm not like the most hardcore player. I like some challenge, but oh, I don't like getting gaped. <laughs> it's not a bad start, though. Uh, thanks for suggesting the game to me and letting me know about it and uh, the game's 269 on Steam So it's not super expensive. It's pretty cheap. Thanks for watching as always guys if you could please like and subscribe. Bye